The report is showing a widening gap between younger and older Australians in their financial comfort. Big reason for this is because older Australians feel much more comfortable because they own their own home, whereas younger Australians are really struggling to buy their first home. Come auction day, uh, so often we're being outbid by baby boomers. Basically, our parents looking for investment properties, just able to pay that little bit more than we were. And we weren't comfortable to stretch, so you know, we just had to watch the property go. Housing prices have more than doubled since 2000, while salaries and investments just haven't gone up at the same rate. So for younger Australians, it's really hard to get their foot on the property ladder. It was tough. Saving for the home took quite a while to build up the deposit. We had to cut down on all the unnecessary expenses, um, clothing, shoes, that sort of stuff around the house, just uh, hand-me-downs instead. We were lucky in the end to get what we actually wanted as opposed to settling for something else. Younger Australians should start thinking about buying a home as soon as they can to really set themselves up for their wealth journey in future. Our biggest piece of advice is start a savings habit as soon as you can and stick to it. We're also seeing consumers do different things like buying an investment property instead of a first home or maybe buying with friends and family or alternatively even buying property off the plan.